Hello, welcome. In this short video, let us look at a wireless communication channel causing a multipath effect. Specifically, we will look at how to use Laplace transform to write the transfer function of this multipath channel. In wireless communications, a multipath channel can be represented as follows. We have the input x of t that goes through different channels, each with the, its own delay. It is delay t naught, and then we have delay t1 and so on up to delay tn so each one of these is a channel and at the receiver we, we see the combined effect of these multiple channels and each one having their own attenuation alpha it is alpha naught, alpha 1 and so, and so on up to alpha n. So the final output is a sum of weighted sum of these delayed inputs. The final output is y of t. So for this multipath channel the output y of t can be written as the sum the weighted sum of alpha naught multiplied by x of t minus t naught that is the input going through the first channel with delay t naught and multiplied by the attenuation alpha naught and then we have the second channel alpha 1 multiplied by t x of t minus t1 and by repeating this process n times we have alpha n that is the component due to the nth channel the component due to the n plus 1 channel now in communications the input is typically an exponential function that is e power s t which is basically a complex exponential then the output y of t can be written as e power s t multiplied by alpha naught e power minus s t naught that is x of t minus t naught becomes e power s t multiplied by e power minus s t naught Similarly, the second term is alpha 1 multiplied by e power minus st1 and finally n plus 1 term is alpha n e power minus stn. Therefore, the output y of t can be written as e power st multiplied by the transfer function h of s where the transfer function h of s is written as the sum alpha naught e power minus st naught plus alpha 1 e power minus st1 and so on up to alpha n e power minus s t n that is the delays in the individual channels become exponentials in the s domain that is h of s can be written as a weighted sum of complex exponentials that is summation from n equal to 0 to n alpha small n e power minus s t n where this t n is the delay in the nth channel does the time delays in individual channels become exponentials in the s domain and the output y of t is written in the eigen form x of t multiplied by eigen function form x of t multiplied by the transfer function h of s clearly the input x of t is an eigen function of this linear time invariant system thus the wireless communication channel causing a multipath effect can be represented by using a eigen function form eigenfunction form such that y of t is equal to x of t multiplied by the transfer function h of s. Thus, a Laplace transform can be used to characterize a wireless communication channel. Thanks for watching.